We got good tunes in Cannibal Town. Cowboy Petey. Oh, they will actually talk to us. We're gonna have to be like, uh, somebody says that you're gonna eat them. Howdy, strangers! Y'all here for the barbecue? Cowboy Val. You cannon. <laughs> Listen, uh, we heard someone calling for help. We're here to investigate. They're just going to be mad. It smells delicious. Mind if we go in? We're starving. Maybe we can fool them. Oh, help yourselves. Oh, and cool. Make sure to say hello to the boss while you're at it. If you ask real nice, he might even let you take a turn on the spit. Yeah. That was easy. Hey there, partners. Name's Roland Giff. Welcome to my jamboree. Now step right up and get yourself some grub. Oh, this is gonna be bad. He's gonna like force us to eat. We actually, uh, we just ate. You ain't had <laughs> nothing like this, friends. Oh, this little lady's been slow disgusting. roasted till the meat just falls off the bone. Thanks, but yeah, we need to work up a real appetite before we dig into a meal like that. Hoo-hee! I knew you folks was all right the minute I laid eyes on you. Listen, cool. now that we all acquainted, maybe you could do me a little favor. Some of my people have gone missing, and I am keen to get them back. There are five folks I'm looking for. A young feller named Alfredo. A sweet little filly named Arlene, and three brothers, Daryl, Daryl, and Larry. He's gonna make me ask why they both named Daryl. Last I heard, Larry and the Daryls are bison ranchers. Alfredo's oh. working at the bazaar, and Arlene was camping out downtown in Colorado Springs. Okay, I think we picked up an Alfredo head in the bazaar, some type of quest item. I want him back. Dead or alive. Yes. Understand? Now, there's a reward for bringing in all five. Yes, sir. Something you can't find anywhere else. So the guy at the bazaar, I think we you can probably him, tell him. You let me know. I think that's what it was, but. Well, howdy, partners. What's cooking? Yeah, here we go. We found Alfredo refused to come back, so we killed him like you asked. Here's the proof. Not exactly how it went down. What a waste. Man could make a marinade that bring tears to your eyes. <laughs> Better dead than fled, I always say. You got anything else for me? Not yet. Well, then help yourself to some barbecue. So downtown Colorado Springs is easy enough. Uh, we have some type of generator here. Okay, controlling turrets. Ooh, power armor back here. A suit of power armor is well maintained, but appears to be missing several major components. No one will be using it anytime soon. Level 9 lockpick. Dumpsters full of charred bones, frozen bags of intestines, and used napkins. Weird. Record player. Dapper youthful cannibals. What's this? Skullcap helmet. Fits your head like a jock, and it kind of smells like one, too. <laughs> <laughs> Seven armor, though. That ain't bad. We can give that to Scotchmo. He likes wearing the, wearing the weird stuff. Better. That's freaking... That's a bit weird. Bit of a weird one. Let's talk to whoever this is. I love the smell of long pig in the morning. Smells uh -huh. like hickory. Dave Steeler. Long pigs drive me crazy, and I can't help myself. Who's the best sneaky? We're A tier on Quan, right? Yeah. It's all, yeah, it's all Quan. Perception and sneak. Turbocharger vehicle upgrade. Requires Morningstar AI module. World map speed plus 33. That's sick. We need the lock picking over here. Too bad that uh, Quan doesn't have that. I'm gonna actually. I'm gonna wait for this. This guy. Eat from the flame, only ease my stomach pain. Hmm. 
Maybe they'd be cool with this? Hold on, let me send, like, we have a lockpick here, too, or why? Maybe the person we're looking for is back in here? He's still chilling there. What the? That's weird. So weird. So we don't even have a quest for this. We don't even have a quest for this. Call to action was Morningstar. Cinema, cornered rats is all old. Disappeared. Forced to kill Betsy and her friends. Yeah. Weird. Okay. Well, let's just try it. That's my workshop. Ah, frick. You see that pitmaster suit? <laughs> Bring those deserters back and you can have it. But I'd appreciate it if you kept out of there. I see. Okay. There's the power armor, locker, computer as well. So what about... Appreciate it if you'd leave those deserters in there marinating. Oh, that's got to be where she is then. The voice that we heard, right? I don't see a way of doing this without killing these guys. We could probably disarm the... Uh, turret thing first. The are cannibals and can't be trusted either. And then I could take this because we don't care about how we get that done. Uh, find those people for him. He's sketch and somebody here called out needing help. I wonder if that's going to start a brawl here. Nope, they're too dumb. Hmm. I'm going to I'm going to set this up. I think we are I think we are going to fight this. Oh, whoops. 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 Over here. Aluka come to this side. <sighs> Am I should I just be going to shoot up cannibals and stuff? I think so. Like, we want to help the person. So I'm just going to go for it. Striking first gives us Frick. tactical advantage. Yeah. Unless you whiff. Oh, this guy. We're going to have to take out this whole group. Let's get this gate guard on the right, too. What's our shotgun AOE like right now? Not bad, actually. Underwhelming. <laughs> Underwhelmed. Oh, oh, we don't have the brainwave in here. It's been a while. And now by swapping those both out, we kind of got screwed on our ammo. Hmm. This is not ideal. Let's go precision here. We'll go for the legs. I'm fine with that. 
I'm all in on the this main guy first, I think. How much armor does he have? 27? Destroyed armor. Sick. Big crits. Big daddy. To be a decent, like, rocket opportunity. Big boy is down. We got some lucky stuff happening. We are super flanked up top there. Carry our actions. Scotch, carry your actions. Oh, wait. We can switch this. Nice crit. Could have killed here too, but... If guys weren't cannibals, I wouldn't have handled this the way that we're handling it, I don't think. My Holy crap. That's a crit. Oof. They're critting hard. That will nice do. heal. Thank you. Okay. Abbott. I think we want to go on this dude. He's out of range. That gives me the two down below. From here, I could get the guy above, I think. I could try it with others, but... A single crit was had that day. want to brainwave destabilize on one guy. Frick. Down to 6 AP here. Yeah, this is actually not ideal. Juan, what can you do? You can hit this guy. 79. Not bad, dude. Reload. Sick. That was actually... That's big. Ooh, what happened there? Whoa, what's this? What the frick? Where'd these guys come from? Bimbus Bill? What the? Hold on. Did she hit this? Not quite. This is going to hurt for sure. William Scar up above. He looks like he has a big gun. Damn. We needed a crit there. Math, defend. 
Hope for the best. Need a place to live. Don't make me. Jeez. These turrets are what turrets are what worries me. It's not the other stuff. Holy crap! These guys are hitting so hard. Thanks. Thought I was done there for a sec. Got to get down here to Costello. See if we can hit both of these guys. Resisted it? Are you freaking serious? Two turns there. We do have like the hail of bullets though. Trying to decide if I should come down here and grab this one while I can. Maybe I should start with that. Math, just defend, because... Whew. One of these turrets is not really helping. In Reagan's name. It's going to take so many turns. Let's go defense here. And just stim. He might drop. Math is going to drop. What did we do wrong? Get you! Other than that, just stop me. Party bot experiencing pain for the first time. It'll take more than that to stop me. Back from the dead and better than ever. Okay, Scotch is down. Math did not go down, actually. We can get Abbott up. Let's start hitting. Maybe up top. This Let's take a reload. I'll see where we can move to. 49 here. It's not bad. Some of our shots will land. Not bad, actually. In Reagan's name. These guys aren't even moving towards the gate, so I'll just... Take those shots and hope for the best. It's not at all how I was hoping that this would go down, but... Let's just uh, defend for a second here. Same thing and same thing. I get you. Rick. I think 
our tank is taking a real dick punch. Come on, Abbott. What? <laughs> Come on. Wow, dude. There's one down. What an absolute backfire this has been. Let's get Scotchmo. Now Needs to get everyone way over here. We can give him a kit. Jeez. Oh, thanks. Uh, now, where was I? Okay, so we'll take two shots on this one. I think maybe prepare would be better. We might even be able to get more shots out of it. Let's ambush where we can. Not bad, we got shocked on. Sweet. Should have run Costello way up there. Let's take a reload here with our extra actions. Is he overwatched? rare Oh for medical attention Oh you're dying you're dying period A hey, clone needs healing Can't do anything with you. Let's go up top. Beautiful. I don't want to hit, hit the clone here, but I feel like if I don't take this, this guy likely kills the clone anyway. Oh, the clone's going to bleed out. He's going to bleed out. That's okay. We can grab his goo and go make a new one. Hold on a second here. Uh, can oh, he doesn't have he doesn't have any first aid, right? What if I just gave him one point in first aid so that I could throw a dart, a med dart? Oh, I need four in first aid. Holy crap!
And I suppose the other thing that removes bleeding is the same idea. Where is it? Removes bleeding requires one first aid. And it costs two AP. Hmm. I think he's just going to fall here. We'll have to rebuild him. It'll be better with every evolution. I have to believe it. Keep your head down there, Scotch. Ooh. See the bleed here after this clone attacks? You should die. Yeah, that sucks. Oh, the counteroffensive was wasted. 47s only. Jesus. <laughs> Scotch mode levels from it. No, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not the stag. My God. Jeez. Okay, we gotta make sure we get that goo. That's our first time we've been like, you know what? No, we're actually going to kill you instead of do what you want. And uh, it worked, went about as expected. That's not the preferred approach. But as far as I can tell, Unless we're not able to save these people. Money. Semi-auto pistol. There's the pink goo. Bring everyone back here. Oh. Oh, no. Nothing. Workshop key. WRK shop. We don't even see anyone in here, though. That's the, okay. That's what I thought. What the frick? That's weird. Oh, here's the workshop key. Two to power armor is well maintained. No one will be using it anytime soon. So how do we take it? The monitor displays the work in progress plans for the Pitmaster 3000. The gold fringe seems pretentious. Goat cannon? Unleashes some serious headbutting on your enemies. Vehicle upgrade for mortar. So it's, <laughs> it's damage. And we have a goat tail. But I don't get why I can't, like, take this armor. And then where's the person that called us for help? Like, this seems like a dead end, but we, we had people run at us. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I probably did something too weird. Didn't seem that weird. All things considered. But like, what's interesting about this place is it never even brought up like a, an actual mission. So it's probably just one of those things where we can investigate it and kind of do whatever we felt like doing. Which is what we did. Look at, we got our level... Seven sniper rifle now. We'll do... Yeah, let's go coordination. And we'll give him that new gun straight away.
There we go. So this is 6 AP. This one's 6 AP. In a way, it's kind of nice to have them both, but it's also nice having the, um, the AOE sniper rifle. But look at this damage now. Oh, that's going to be just disgusting. I actually feel like we could justify some of these higher up mods on this gun. I know we said we want to save these for like level 10 guns, but we don't know when we're going to get those. We just need to get Lucia back. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. How far are we? Hold on. Animal compound is no more. I Maybe it was a trap. Like, maybe that was the whole thing. If we would have brought up that somebody called for us, it could have just been an ambush and we would have to fight them anyways. Or we could have done that. What we did, talk to the guy, kind of help him and then get the, get the suit of armor or whatever. But then it was clear that it was there and we could, we could pick the lock and I thought we could access it. I maybe got a little too, a little too hog wild. You know what I'm saying? Now, I know we were on our way to Aspen, but I kind of feel like now we want to take our thing back, do our, do some of the, the vehicle upgrades, get repaired, get healed, get the vehicle repaired and, uh, get our clone back. And we're not too far. Heed the words of the prophet, brothers and sisters. Make your kites strong, so the offerings they bear will reach the heavens above. Take you the supple skin of the sacrifice, carve it in a single piece from belly and back, and stretch it upon a rack of metal or wood. Scrape the skin clean and anoint it with sacred oils. Jeez. Then leave it under the blessed sky for seven days and nights. Take the long bones of leg and arm and lash the torso onto the kite. Thus will the workings of the flesh bear your gift aloft into the presence of the gods. Nice little insight there. Okay, so Ranger HQ. We'll, uh, we'll heal, we'll check our vehicle upgrades, and we'll check our personal upgrades, and then we'll head out and make north for uh, Aspen again. I'm trying to think, like, um, just of the various ways that that one could have went down. If you guys have played that, and you took, like, an alternate path, let me know. I assume... Had we helped him, maybe we would, maybe we'd actually get the armor. Sure. I don't know how good it will have been by the time we helped him. Who knows? Might also be people at Ranger HQ looking for help. It's possible. Jeez. Where's all my frames? There we go. All right, let's check this out. Equipment chassis. So we're at uh, 1,000 constitution, level 2 radiation resistance, world map speed 50, but... Rhino cannon. Holy crap. Rail gun. Huge piece of rebar at a target at supersonic speeds. Supersonic blast launches a projectile that penetrates through multiple targets in a row, dealing extra damage. 434. I mean, this is not too far off. This is 400, but they each have to hit. I think we take the rail gun. Here's the goat cannon. Caltrops is nice, though. This can apply stunned as well. Armor plating, 250 and 60 armor, but combat speeds. That's a pretty big hit, actually. But if we wouldn't have had that, probably dead in that fight. Here's Morningstar. Oh, so Morningstar is giving extra action points. Oh, cool. Then Utility, the turbocharger. So now, because we have the Morningstar module, we're going even faster on the world map speed, which means we get around... Uh, we get to our destination sooner. Night Rider Horn. Hell yeah, dude. We're a disco bot on the front.
We'll heal up. We'll make a new clone. What do you need, Rangers? You need to be patched. Have a seat. If it ain't cut, don't stitch it. What do you need, Rangers? Uh, let's buy some medical supplies. Sure. So we've been sitting on a lot of junk. Let's just buy all of those. And we'll buy some injury kits. Maybe like 10 of them. You... You want me to make another clone? Yes, please. Yes, go ahead. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Bill's slapping noise, chassis slapping noise. Just wait for it. Come on out, clone. What is this arc? This is our third clone, technically. We got the first one. And then we got uh, two. Re this is our second replacement. Bro. There we go. Huh. Awesome. Thank you. Oh, we need to get patched up again because he probably had a, a constitution hit on his injury. That's what. Have a seat. Ooh, someone's down at that door. I won't. I never do. What are you doing down here? A kid victory sounds like a bad apple. This is... Numeric keypad. Yeah, see, we don't have any codes. We could randomly match buttons. If you're trying to enter the display clears, the door gives no sign of moving. It's enormous and recessed in the walls, floors, and ceiling. It seems the only way to get through it is a numeric keypad on the wall. Let's do a quick inventory for uh, weapons. So we need some more uh, bolts for sure. Need a reload here. Definitely need to buy some energy cells, bolts, uh, 50. And then I guess the 30 odd six in case we switch back to the other sniper rifle. Whoa, Abbott was just winding up to shoot that guy. What the frick was that? You know, this place could be a real moneymaker. If those refugees weren't here, that fight never would have happened. Let me show you. All right. Let's go energy cells. We'll buy... Wait, does he not sell bolts? some of these how many rockets do we have we're sitting on 23 of these rockets believe it or not what's interesting is oh that's not bad um we don't he doesn't sell the bolts here so we have to buy those from somebody else all right. Just we're out of that as well. I want to see what Fastback is selling. Auto in charge. Of course. Let's see if we can find what you want. Rhino cannon, defender chassis. So this is level one radiation, which we don't need. I don't know if there's more than level two, so let's keep our eye out for it. And then let's do our last little. Uh, our last little upgrades here. So perks wise, we're going to grab sniper rifles. 10% hit chance if you don't move, which generally we're abiding by. We're going to save for level 10 here. And then what? We'll just save those. See how we end up. Okay. So mechanics or nerd stuff. Now let's, let's just hold on a second here. Let's get rid of mechanics. So if I take mechanics here, actually, hold on. If I take nerd stuff, because we don't have a book for it, 
then what I can do is use mechanics and keep that utility item in. So we're going to max out nerd stuff. We haven't found a book for it. We'll probably find it in the next 10 minutes. Attributes wise. Range damage, I don't care. I mean, crit chance is, is nice. You max out 25. Or we just go into charisma with him to level up his other skills faster. Tax and blunt and melee weapons critically hit stunned and blind. Extra combat speed when you have two melee weapons equipped, which we do. Take that. Okay. Quan, kiss ass is maxed. Love to see it. Is that because... No, he's, he's naturally maxed kiss ass now. So we're going to save this for sneaky shit. I'm going to go an extra point in strength just to get better armor here. And we'll save this one as well. Maluka. 10 on explosives. Getting weapon and armor modding buffs. We take this. We put her at 9. We don't have any guns that require more than 6 for big guns right now. Coordination, strength is max. Let's keep going on awareness. And then, radius of grenades and other AoE effects increased. So, with that, we should probably start carrying a rocket launcher. Law. Something like that. Just get rid of some of this stuff. Okay. We're still holding these. That's fine. If we want to get to a natural 10 or uh, a 10 in toast repair, it's going to have to be a natural 10 because we used that book earlier. A survival point wouldn't be bad. There's a couple of times that's potentially come into play, but we're so close to hitting this, we might as well save that. Uh, speed, strength. You know what? Let's take the strength. This is level six. There is that specific armor set here that he needs seven strength for. But then he's got like, that's a huge increase for him. Even though he's not supposed to be super tanky, he's kind of going down that path. And then lastly here, Scotchmo, our hobo. Um, I really don't know what to put his points into. Because uh, I guess, I guess weapon modding. Just so that the people that we replace, they all kind of operate the same way. Because it's nice having someone that can do it. Take this loot bonus. And then take coordination. Cool. I can't wait to see that gun. Now, I'm, I'm also going to go and get... I'm going to go get Lucia back in the party. Just feel like currently she adds more. What happens after you take Kansas? Nice. A time of... I've heard Valor was always a strange child. I hope he uses this time to sort himself out. He does have a brilliant mind. Uh, how have you been keeping busy? I train, clean my guns, talk to the others, and try to learn more about the world beyond Broadmoor Heights. I have plenty to do with my time. You want to join us again? <laughs> there is still injustice in the world, isn't She's there? probably like, holy frick. Let's go. See you later, Scotchmo. <clears throat> oh, she is. She does have the gun back. Oh, thank God. Okay. So... It doesn't show up in the party transfer screen, but she does actually keep that gun. So in the future, if we want to be swapping these to other people, we need to we need to hold up, you know? 
So we're going to go into small arms now. Keep improving our hit chance. Um, yeah. Let's do that. The bartering seems okay. Let's go coordination. Actually, no. Let's finish intelligence. For the crits, like we talked about. First attack after reloading costs no AP. Sure. Quan we're holding. Do they have any sneaky shit stuff? Look at that. Sneak attack damage 200%, which isn't actually that good on him. Because our sneak attack, we want to come from somebody that's hitting real hard, like our sniper. All right, guys. It's out of here. We're gone. Oh, let's talk to him maybe about the bazaar real quick. The refugees have my utmost sympathies. But their inability to respect the boundaries of others, particularly in such close quarters, is distressing. Have a pleasant day. <laughs> and a most pleasant day to you too, November. All right. It's been an interesting last couple of uh, episodes. Morning Star. We could ask how he's doing. I am delighted. The garage is an impressive space, staffed with well qualified personnel. It is a lot less lonely than where I was previously quartered. I feel that. You want to go for a ride, Morning Star? Time to take some chances and expand <laughs> man's horizons. Yeah, buddy. I wonder if there will be conflict. There's no more exhilarating feeling than being shot at with no result. Okay, let's uh, let's head to the world map, guys. Let's wrap it up here. When we come back, uh, we're gonna hopefully get to Aspen. We should be cruising a little bit faster. Um, yeah, we should be able to get there without too many problems. But if we do, we'll deal with them, and hopefully make our way towards taking down the second kid. And then the the last kid's gonna be the toughest, obviously. But our guys are like, I feel like we're leveling our dudes super well and like there's not many checks right now that we're running into that we can't handle we've got max hard ass max kiss ass max lock pick max uh mechanics nerd stuff like we kind of have all the really key ones in my opinion so anyways hopefully it works out for us see you guys very soon bye for now your days are numbered desert rangers oh the red scorpion militia wipe you out stand forth just the beginning Interesting. Cool. Okay. One warm greeting. <laughs>